Hello and welcome back for more NASCAR Legends. Championship is the thing that I'm trying to eventually get to. Bristol, Bristol, Bristol. Racing the way it ought to be. Bristol, the Southeastern 500. 125 laps in Tennessee. Let's skip, uh, go right to qualifying. Let's start qualifying. Quick qualify, come on. I'm way at the back of the pack. Here we go. Bristol hasn't changed much in the last 50... Has it been 50 years? Oh. It's still the same high banked crazy thing. Whoa. Look at that banking. Gotta be careful in the corners. Because the car has a tendency to, to wanna snap back in toward the inside. 19.065, that's not very good. I think I can do faster than that. Let's try this. That should be faster. 18.133, that should be good. Bring it on in. Okay. It's brung on in. I am on the pole position! Next to Richard Petty! Uh, in front of Donnie Allison and AJ Foyt and Cale Yarbrough and David Pearson and so on and so forth. Next session. Race. Let's go racing, boys! Alright, so Bristol's a little, a lot trickier than you'd be used to in your modern day NASCAR games. Because back then, we're, they're running on the skinny tires. They don't have the big, real wide racing slicks like they do now. So when you come into the corners, you don't have as much grip as you'd think. It's almost like, uh,. Skating on ice. Ice skating. Okay, get ready. Going green. Get ready, we're going green. Pace car's in. Watch the pace car. Watch the pace car. Watch the green flag. Green flag, green flag, green flag. Car high. Ugh! Ugh! Pass me already. Shouldn't not do that. Ah! But the good thing about Bristol is there's... It, with this concrete, I think they repaved it with asphalt at some point recently. But with this concrete, there's so... it's so wide. There's so many grooves to run into. It's unbelievable. Whoop! There's a little bit of that under or oversteer. Ooh. Try not to hit the wall too much. You gotta be real, real delicate coming out of the turns. Because the car just wants to snap right back into the inside wall, and that's no good. We're gonna have fourth place. Not doing too bad. Stay in position. I've been through Tennessee a few times. 
uh, Bristol is like they always talk about it being like the fourth biggest city in Tennessee or something when it's when it's racing weekend because there's so many fans that show up because back back whoops in the modern times they have like a hundred fifty thousand seats there but back back here this just got look at them they're sitting right on the grass man that is a that is crazy I can't even imagine it's like taking a picnic basket out on to go watch some NASCARs oh I didn't wreck him too hard. Just wanted to rattle his cage. Thank you, sir. I'm driving fast, turning left, and sometimes running into sh things. You've got a slow car down low. But man, this is way, way different than than modern Bristol. Thank Bristol you. now is like as a a football stadium practically and it actually is they're gonna actually play a football game there a uh, college football game there sometime this year I forget who the teams are but they're gonna have the they're gonna play it in the infield so I don't know what they're gonna do I guess they're gonna have to like remove all the garages and stuff because there's like things built up in the infield there but man I'm gonna watch that because that's that's going to be fun. Oop. Whoop. No, no, it's been around. Keep going. Well, see, the good thing about um, short track racing is that your uh, aerodynamics aren't really particularly important. That was a stupid thing to do. Dynamics don't matter so much when you're okay, that car behind you is so close, so close together and such. Driving so fast. This is like a speed bowl, man. Coming right on this car. Oh! Give him a little touch. Do it again. Yeah, rock and roll in here at Bristol. Yeah, this is fun. I've been through Tennessee a few times. I went through the Nashville airport one time. I was actually going to meet a friend of mine who lives in Atlanta. Whoops! That's not good. Go. Go, 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 go. Um, and at the time, Southwest didn't fly into Nash, into, uh, Atlanta. So, I had to fly into Nashville and rent a car to, to go see him. And the Nashville airport is like exactly as you would imagine if you were racing the car behind you. If it was all the stereotypes that you were looking for. That's all exactly what it what it looks like. They got the country music playing in the in the airport and everything. Everybody speaks there with the uh, with the accent and stuff. I like the accents. <laughs> they got a they got a hockey team in Nashville. Why do they have a hockey team in Nashville and they don't have a real hockey team in Seattle? I can't understand that. I mean, you know, no offense to the to the fans of the Predators, but you know 
I don't, I don't, I don't get that. Um, actually, their fans are pretty kind of rowdy and lewd. When I was there, I was there once. I went to a Nashville Predators game. They were playing the Phoenix Coyotes because I like to follow the Phoenix Coyotes for some reason. I don't know. I guess I'm like hoping that they'll someday move to here <laughs> and become the Seattle Coyotes, but that doesn't seem too likely or whatever. Or maybe I'm just fond of endangered species. But I like their jerseys and stuff. But uh, yeah, I was in was uh, in Nashville, and uh, it's like the only person in Nashville with a Phoenix Coyotes jersey on. And I had I had great tickets too, because I was right in front of the right next to the penalty box, right on the glass and stuff. So, of course, they were pretty rowdy and stuff. They got their stupid thing okay, just like, hey, hey, you suck. Line. You know, the vulgarities and their and crap like that. You know, juvenile stuff. That was kind of stupid. Okay, get ready. Oh, Stay shit! Stay behind the 118 car. Just let him by. Oh. These cars in. This is not going to be good. Green flag, green flag, green flag. Um, okay. Now that I've completely lost my train of concentration. Whoa. Keep low. Clear high. Um. You are racing the car behind you. Where am I? <laughs> ha! Wow. Okay. Good thing there's no pit road speed limits back then. Bonk. Ah! I got a whole mess of cars to pass today. Um, yeah, the Nashville Predator fans are kind of, you know, lewd and stuff. It's like, I don't know, I don't, I don't particularly like that kind of language, you know, around children and stuff. It's like what I like to think I like to think of hockey as a family kind of game, and I want to get the uh, you know the little kids interested in hockey and stuff. Cause the little kids all love hockey. I mean, they they just dig it up. I mean, you see their faces light up when their guy scores. It's and they love the fights and everything. It's amazing. It's way better than any other sport. You know. And it's really, and the kids, and I, I like the, I like the kids to be, you know, part of that. So when they chant those like vulgar, kind of stuff, it just, you know, I just think it's unclassy and disgusting. I hear they do it in New Jersey too, but that's, you know, kind of expected of New Jersey. You kind of expect to be classless in New Jersey, because it's New Jersey, man! What a hole! It's the, it's the home of Bon Jovi and Bruce Springsteen. Ugh. Okay, Bon Jovi had a couple cool songs, like Raise Your Hands, that was a cool song. Raise your hands when you wanna let it go, raise your hands, and, and, Shot through the heart, and you're to blame, but and you give love a bad name. But, you know, all his power ballads were just trash. Oh, God. Can't stand that guy now. And he's still around. He's still making albums. Shitty albums. It's my life. It's now or never. 50 million Bon Jovi fans can't be wrong. Bite me. God. What was I saying about vulgarity? 
So yeah. I don't know. I just I don't like the the sound. I just don't like that. Uh, You're racing the one car. That uh, that vulgarity, you know, at a at a hockey game. You know, because there's kids around. You know, you want to get kids Still involved there. in the game. Still there. This guy's gonna lap me, isn't he? Still there. Clear. Clear low. The eleven car is lapped down. Oh, he's a lap down, eh? But yeah, it's like. I don't know, it's like people people have this weird thing like they think that they bought a ticket so it's like and they have the first amendment right to to spew whatever diarrhea comes out of their stupid mouths. It's like ridiculous. It's like no you don't have the right to be intentionally offensive. It's like what the hell? You can't, you can't, you can't say those things. I know, I'm one to talk, but really, but, you know, you're not buying a ticket to L10 11 Wide Body Land here, you know, and I do say that it's unsuitable for children under eight. Oh, I'm going forwards and backwards and stuff. Oh, oh. Yeah, he's just spun out. The 117 car is lapped down. Um. Go high. Yeah, but I I like to car think. The way that I feel about vulgarity is that it's like. Personally, in my personal repertoire of my vocabulary, ugh, I like to have those kind of, you know, nuclear options kind of words that I can go to. I'm spinning everybody out now, aren't I? I'm a real, um, what's that Will Ferrell's movie's stupid guy's name? Bobby Ricky? Something like that? Ugh. But it's like, I like to hold those, you know, certain four-letter words in reserve. For when I'm really, when I really need to feel the anger, you know. On the high side, maybe not, maybe. Oh, this is quite fun. Going around in circles. Whoa, there's a car down low. No, that's the leader. You can't pass me, Mr. Leader, man. Oh, there's another leader. Ah! No, I will drive faster than you. At some point. Um, so, yeah, it's like... Well, it's like the thing... Ugh. Do you remember the thing with, like, in, in Spinal Tap, where it's like... With the, these amps go to 11, you know, if you're all the way up, these are going to go one louder, you know? You want to have that something in reserve if you want to go one louder, or one more, you know, intense. So that's what, that's what I can, I feel like it. But sometimes I let it slip, and I sometimes I say things, particularly when James Anderson is getting killed. Which he does a lot for some reason, and I'll get back to him later. Oh man! Oh, you're in the middle, three wide, clear, clear all around. I gotta pass this leader guy again. You're in the middle, three wide. Richard Petty. You're in the middle, three wide. Oh, snap! Oh. Okay, the next car is the leader. Oh. That was ah. Uh, my tires are not happy. I do not have happy tires. They're like worn out and stuff. stuff. Oh. How many laps do I have? Projector laps 34. Okay. I think I can. 
Oh, dude, get out of my way, Mr. 122. Oh, I believe you're fictional. All the triple digit number cars are fictional, from what I think. Oops. Because there wasn't quite enough to fill out the field. Oh, uh. oh, yeah, like that. Whoa! Maybe not like that. Ugh. Ugh. Whoops, that's gonna bring out a yellow. No? No? No yellow flags. Okay, sure. Why not? Okay, I'm doing great. I am in... what position am I in? 34th? What does green mean? I don't understand these colors. Driving fast and turning left. Driving fast and... Turning left. Listen to my spotter. Driving around the Nashville or the Tennessee Hills. I don't know what mountains those are. It's like the uh, Appalachians or the Great Smoky Mountains or the uh, the Blue Ridge Mountains. I think there's a Blue Ridge Mountains, right? Oh, I just love how steep the banking is. There's so much room to maneuver. He says as he uses up all the frickin' apron to make a <laughs> to make amends for his crappy not able to stay in the straight oh somebody's trailing some smoke wonder who that is that's interesting oh I'm in this pack of cars here I can go underneath you, Rich Petty! Whoops! Whoa! Very careful. Man, I've done this track a couple of times. And it's like... Every time I, I, I screw up and crash in too much. It's like I get flashbacks right there that one time. I I was doing a real good race and I and I and I swerved too much on the inside and I spiked the car right into the guardrail. Right in the engine block. It was like, oh no, no more car. And the invisible tow truck was out and everything. Oh no, a caution flag is out. The 11 car is left down. Well, that's good. That'll give me a chance to pit stop. Pit road is blocked. Because I need to pit stop. Looks like you're ready for some tires. I am ready for Order some tires. Caution is out. In. Okay. What a good time for a caution break. Yes, indeed. Some cautions. Which is kind of cool. There's the front stretch cautions and the back stretch cautions. What about turn one? It's closed. Pit road is now open. Do do all the things, man. Okay, the leader's on pit road. Car stop. Now look in turn four. Car stop. Come on, make your magic happen. I'm watching the pace car. Pace car is slowly growing around. But everybody else is pitting. Man, pit stops takes way longer back then. It's like now they do it in like 14, 15 seconds, but back then it was like, oh. Well, also they're hammering on some damage or something. The pace car in turn three. Oh, come on. Don't let the pace car get flat me. 
the pace cars and turn four. Come on. Fix the car stop down low and turn one. The pace cars on the front street. Shit. How much damage did I do to my car? I should have told it to not repair damage. The pace cars in turn one. Now I'm two laps down. The pace cars in turn two. Ugh. Two laps down. I think I can make it up. I've got a lot of laps to go, actually. We're lap 65 to go. That's a lot of, quite a few laps. I think I'm pretty good at this track. I think. <laughs> yeah. I'm going for that championship thing. Oh, oh shit. Well, he just stopped. He stopped right in front of me. What did that? We're not on the lead lap. Get on the inside line. Inside line. All right. Yeah, I'm going. Double file restarts. I shouldn't have told him to fix my damage. I would be on okay, um, just Don't a worry. lap down, and I would be. I didn't think about it. Pace car's in. Pace car's in. Well, hopefully we can get some laps back. Green flag, green flag, green, green, green. Go! We've got trouble in turn four. We've got trouble in turn four. The yellow flag is out. What? What? Car what do you mean? Clear all around. We've got trouble in turn four and the yellow flag is out. Keep low. Clear oh! Well, that's uh, some kind of trouble. Go, 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 move vehicle, accelerate, V8, all systems nominal. Oh, I'm still two laps down. Why did that happen? What was that? I don't understand. They always say cautions breed cautions, but it was like there was a caution inside of a caution. It's like cautionception. See, I'm referencing that movie that I haven't seen. That everybody else talks about. How am I on my fuel? Projected last 83. Well, I got enough fuel to go the rest of the way. So I should be good, so I don't need to pit. I don't know about them tires, though. Okay, here's the halfway point. My halfway point, and I'm 36th place and two laps down. Ah. That's okay. I'll figure something out. Let's see. Tennessee is the sh only state that's shaped like a knife. That's a fun fact, I guess. What else is there in uh, Tennessee? There's Nashville. There's Memphis. Memphis has, like, uh, the blue stuff, right? Blues is like a music thing. Yep. I don't know, I usually associate blues with St. Louis because of the hockey team. In fact, I can relate everything in my life to hockey. Did I ever mention I like hockey? I think I have. One more lap 
left to green. One more lap to green. So we should be splitting out on the inside line here. We're not on the lead lap. Get on the inside line. So that'll help a little bit. Uh, whoops. So maybe we'll be able to get a lap back. I'm behind a Ford. Uh, Ford. Uh, 227. I can't tell from here. Okay, get ready. Going green. Going green. Going Stand green. Right I don't know, Tennessee's uh, seemed like a nice place to visit. Green flag, green flag, green flag. Car up high. Keep low. The yellow flag is out. Car what? Stop. Down low. And turn four. What do you mean the yellow flag is out? Oh no! Car up high. Clear high. I don't understand. The yellow flag is out. What? Oh, I'm skidding all over the place. We're under caution. What? Oh, why are we under caution again? Oh, take that wall. Oh, I think somebody warned me about the artificial intelligence being not intelligent on this particular track and that cautions would happen frequently for no apparent reason which is what's happening right now Ugh. the things I suffer for you, for free entertainment, man. I love you guys. Thanks for watching, by the way, you know? I really appreciate it. I didn't even think this NASCAR thing would be that popular, but it's like, I did, you know, I really, really warms my heart when people actually comment on it and stuff. You know, because I like NASCAR, and I like these big old cars. So it's just, you know, it's nice to hear hear from you guys. I'm not trying to be too, you know, sappy or anything, but oh well. It's just, it's just nice to, it's just nice to feel like a community, if that makes sense. You know? And see, that's the thing of my... I, I think that's like the, uh, the sort of uh, 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 standard that I set myself to as far as making videos is to make it feel like you're, you know, comfortable, like you're, like you're sitting next to me and I'm talking about the game to you playing the game and talking to you about it, you know, and just kind of letting my thoughts roll. We're not on the lead lap. Get on the inside line. You know, and I know that's not how a lot of a lot of Let's Players do it a different way. You know, they do it where they just they just show off the game and they don't even like look at the controls and everything look up the I mean look up the controls look at the manual you know and that's on the back straight I okay get ready going green you know there's guys like uh, Steve Steve Benway and uh, crow 111 you know they're real real cool guys but uh, You know, it's just, I feel like, um, oh, spinning around.
Oh, this isn't gonna be good. Just as I was doing so well, or something. Car up high. Um. Still there. Still there. Yeah, as I was saying. Clear high. But it's like I feel, I feel I'm more Maybe obligated to be. I don't want to say friendlier, because that's not really the word I want to use. You know, but it's like... It's sort of like... I get the feel from those guys... You know, I, I really respect them for what they do. Especially Crow. You know, he's got an amazing setup. And he does all those kind of... His fancy video tricks and stuff. You know, and he's really into the pinball and everything. And he's... You know, he's got a real great setup. I really respect that. But it's more like, I feel like when I'm watching his videos, I don't feel like I'm coming over to, like, a friend's place. I feel like I'm more like in a museum, if that makes sense. It's like, you know, it's more like a, uh, uh, I don't want to say a guided tour because it's really not that. But it's like, more like an exhibit. Then, uh. Please don't be yellow. Okay. But, uh, that's, that's just my kind of feeling about it. I just, you know, I kind of feel like. You know, I feel like I'm inviting you into my, you know. You've got a slow car now, look. Home. As it were. You know, to play video games with me and enjoy them and listen to my snarky comments and various references to things and such. I guess that's just my feeling on it. You know, like Steve Steve Benway has a huge collection of games. You know, they both have a, a large collection of games, and I admire that. You know, it's good to show them off and everything. But it's like, like I said, it's like it's like more of an exhibit than a than a than an actual. You know, I'm not sure if I'm uh, making real sense. The 117 car is lap down. Hmm. 117, eh? I should play F117 Nighthawk sometime. But it's like I don't really get a lot out of the out of their videos, unfortunately. It's like they all kind of seem to blend together. You know, there's kind of the what's, ah. There's kind of the uh, there's first there's the initial you know euphoria of it all. And it's like especially with uh, Steve Benway's he was doing a whole mess of. Uh, uh, Amiga CD games like from Britain and he's got his fancy British accent and everything that I didn't know or no, I know about British accents but I mean I didn't know about the Amiga CD oh what am I doing ah, ha, ha. this race is not gonna be a win for me okay Oh, the yellow flag is out. Yeah, I'm cause of that. Let's go, let's go. Race back to the line. Carlo. Clear, clear. I don't care. I've Still there. Clear low. I like this track, but it's just I can't quite seem to not clear. <laughs> under caution. Caution is now. Wind up uh being terrible at it. <laughs> Let's see, that's another thing of the... Oh! Ow! Stop! Ah! 
That's the what? Car stop, down low, on the back straight. Pass the 128 car. Pass the one. Pass the 115 car. I don't see a 115 Pass car. Pass the 40 car. Pass the 40 car? Pass the 40 car. Okay. Car stop, down low, on the back straight. Understood. Pass the 115 car. Okay. Pass the 115 car. Like this then? Pass the 120 car. Sure. Pass the 11 car. Okay. I like this. Pass the 128 car. Yes, of course. Pass the 48 car. Sure. Pass the 6 car. Okay. Car. Sure. Well, that was fun. <laughs> oh, I should slow down. Car stop. Down. Whoop. Spin the tires. But it's like I don't get, I don't really get any interaction from them. It's it, they all kind of seem to blend together, you know. Steve Steve Benway was showing off his his Amiga CD collection, which is pretty cool. I didn't have, you know, I didn't know about all these Amiga CD games. It was kind of cool to see him in action, but it's like he just kind of throws them up there and is like, oh, I don't know what the controls are and that stuff. It's not a walkthrough. It's not a let's play or whatever, what you know. You it's like I don't know. I feel like I. We're not on the lead lap. Get on the inside line. I feel like I deserve more. I deserve. You deserve more than that. That I should be more informative, and you know, such. I'm not intentionally trying to suck at this game, but really, I mean, you're watching it, you know, it's it's not like it's my fault. I mean, you saw the crazy crap that happened to Bowman Gray, man. Look at this here. We're getting ready to go green behind Carl Edwards. Go! No! Ho oh, ho! Why is the yellow flag out? Keep low. Uh. Keep low. Oof! I keep doing things like that. Uh. Oh, Richard Petty, you're yeah, passing me again. You're in the middle. Three wide. Clear No! This road is low. Oh! We got trouble everywhere, man. Car stop, down low. What is, one. is now all this muckety muck? This is ridiculous. Oh, I'm never gonna make those laps back, am I? Thirty-three laps to go. Even if I had 500 laps, I probably wouldn't make it because I keep spinning out like a, like I'm Dukes of Hazard or something. Oh. Uh. But yeah, I like to think I'm more personable than. I. It's not. I. Uh. You know, I I don't want to I don't want to I don't want to say something that sounds disrespectful is the is the thing, you know, because I've really, you know, those guys have, I mean, especially Crow was the guy who got me, you know, even to just think about putting myself on camera, you know, I I I I thought about that 
you know, eventually I, I decided, you know, it didn't really add too much to the to the gameplay, but, you know, I I respect that. You know, and I, and I respect his setup and everything. You know, and I really admire his, his gameplays, but it's like... Uh, there's really no delicate way to put this, but it's like sometimes they all just kind of seem to blend together. You know? Car stop, now up, in turn one. It's, I don't know. It just seems like maybe if you uh, took a little bit of time to look at, at least look at the controls or something, or at least look a little bit at the backstory. No, so I know that. One more lap to green. Um, was that one recent one that Crow was doing was uh, seven seven twenty degrees? The the, uh, the uh, skateboard game was Skater Guy. And he was saying that it was Skate or Die, that it was ported as Skate or Die on the NES, but they put up some, 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 you know, text on the on the video itself that said, no, it wasn't. It was a completely different game. It was unrelated, but they got the idea from, from, from the from the phrase from 720 degrees. But it's like, okay, get ready. I, what couldn't you have? Uh, uh, done that little bit of research like before ahead of time it's just green flag, green flag. Green, green, green. it's just car stop now up in turn four car stop now up in turn four car high i don't know it's just it just seems like keep low keep low keep low it seems like i'm busting my ass out here you know, doing more work than I really should, than I really need to put into just to make you, sure you guys are entertained, that's all, you know? And it's like, no, nah, I don't want to, I don't want to, whoops, I don't want to do that. We've got trouble in turn three. Please don't be caution, please don't be caution, please don't be caution. Fuck! What was I saying about vulgarity? Ah! Get out of my way! Damn it! Oh. I am behind the 21 car, damn it! Ugh! I'm gonna finish this race at least. S suck forever though. But yeah, I don't mean I don't want to disrespect them or anything, but it's like I don't. It, it feels uh, detached, standoffish, maybe. I don't. You know, I. It's like it's not like that. That's not really what what I want to say. You know, because I love their videos and I watch them and everything. But. I don't know. It's, it's, I don't know. I just feel like I, I, I have to go like an extra mile to, you know. To, to do things for, for you guys. I mean, it's like. I. I I don't know. I think I've said pretty much everything I need to say about that. All I could say. Oh. More caution laps. But uh, yeah, no, I I like their videos and everything. So don't get don't get me wrong. It's just I have a little bit of a different take on it, and I guess that's why I do like to do these kind of, you know, in in depth, more in depth long plays or let's plays and long plays and such. 
you know, because I feel like I, I have there, I have more to share with you, you know, because I, I, I appreciate these games, you know, I love these games, I want to showcase the games that I, that I love, you know, I don't just want to throw them up there and, and be like, oh, this game is a bunch of crap and it's like stupid and crap. You know, I mean, even like the 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 car tycoon uh, let's play I did. I mean, man, you don't you don't even know how many hours I've actually played that game, running through in and out. You know, trying to see if it would actually work. You know, and, and, and trying to make it to be the game that I wanted it to be. You know, so I, I, I trash it a lot, but it's... But I real have have a real affinity for for what they tried to do with it. You know, and I respect the game makers for that. Green flag. Ah! Go away! Oh, see what I mean about like ice skating? Oh, bunk. Oop. Sorry about that, uh, Mr. Jones. Ah! <laughs> no! Again? Well, let's see if I can make some positions. Ah, uh, there is not as much racing as I'd hoped. Ooh. I'm trying. Ooh. Crunch. Okay. Stay behind the 114 car. Where is the 114 car? The 114 car. I heard you. I'm looking for him. Stay behind the 114 car. I don't see a 114 car. Just let him by. Oh, there he is. The 11 car. I'm trying to. Pit road is now open. Get out of my way. The 11 car. AJ Foyt. More Your Indy car. Skills are no good here. <laughs> but it's like I feel like I, I have the obligation to, you know, dig real deep into the games like that to share them with you because people work real hard on these games, you know? And especially with, like, the fo the fallouts, you know? And even the, the MVP baseball, you know? There's a lot of work that went in, into those games. Gonna lapse or left 19, huh? I've got uh, more than enough fuel. It's like, you know, I really enjoy those games, so I want to feel like, you know, I'm sharing, you know, something special with you guys. Really, and you know, and command and conquer and stuff too. It's like. I know I got some come you know there's a couple of comments on the uh, like the some of my missions like oh why didn't you build more ore miners and why didn't you do the destroy the whatchamajig or whatever and it's like well you know kind of the thing that I'm trying to do is like it's like trying to sit down and you know have a casual you know fun fun you know sit together, you know, between friends and playing, playing video games. So it's like, you know, and, and you screw up once in a while. Or, in this case, you know, a lot of times. So it's like, I feel, I feel like that's more entertaining, you know, than having to be perfectly picture clear on everything, you know. There's all kinds of walkthroughs and everything. We're not on the lead 
for 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 Red Alert 2 and such, and and Descent, you know. But it's like I I feel I feel like I'm inviting you into my home. That's all, you know. So. Okay, get ready. Going green. Uh, sorry if that's a little too personal for you guys. <laughs> but you don't have a choice. Ha <laughs> ha! I outrank you. I am the content creator. Okay. Oh, Fraps is doing a thing. Okay then. Oh dear. Oh shit. Okay, so um there might be some technical proficiencies in the playback there, because Fraps just decided to like all of a sudden be like I don't wanna record like at a frame rate anymore. bunch of crap because it's like getting close to the end here. 13 laps to go. Where's my next car? 6.2 seconds ahead is the number 99. So yeah, we'll just ignore that whatever that happened. I don't even know what that's going to look like. Oh. Probably look better than me scraping the wall! Oh, Bristol, it's the hottest ticket in NASCAR. Oops! It sure is. Well, I'm a lap down too, so it's like, I don't know, we can be a lap down. Together, we give you pen pals, sending laps, last laps, downs to each other. What the hell does that even mean? I am like talking out of my ass here. Although I suppose since I am L1011 wide body, that would be the third engine. Whoa! Oh, what's that snap back? Man, it's wicked. Oh, skinny tires. Jeez. Oh, I lost so much valuable track position. Okay. Let's be more gentle. I gotta at least catch up to this guy, because I can pass him and get a spot. I'm already imagining the newspaper thing again, saying disappointment looms for NASCAR's newest star, or some shit. Ugh. Oh heavens! Here I go. I'm the turn seven to go. Well, not really, because I'm a couple laps down, so... Well, that's 117. I thought I was passing the 99. Carlo. Keep well, I'll pass him anyway. Oh, no! Car high. Oh! The car is like... Car up high. It's clear, like clear, on clear, ice, clear. man. Oh. That's a, okay. Oh. Not there's five more to go. Carlo, you're in the middle, three wide. Clear all right. Oh. Carlo. I thought this was gonna be a win. Oh. Now I'm going around in circles again. Thirty-fourth place, I guess. Something.
something? Car high. Clear. Car high. Ugh. Oh. Clear. Car high. I don't even know what place I'm in. Oh, 34th, Car yes. I do have an actual Car indicator high. on my left hand Clear. side, but you can't see it Clear. Clear. in this camera angle. Oh! Oh! Hello, pit road. I can go a million miles an hour down here because there's no pit road Point speed limit. Oh! The yellow flag is out. Oh, I'm going to finish this race in reverse. <laughs> oh, I lost some positions. What does it even matter? <laughs> doesn't even matter. It's like points mean nothing. It's like the difference between being 157 points down and 158 points down. Ugh. Ugh. This is a real okay, Polish victory lap, man. Alright, there's a flag. Let's get this trailer loaded. I win! Ha 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 ha! Oh, God, that was a <laughs> oh, sh can't I do anything right? Mm -hmm. Boom. <laughs> okay, that's <laughs> that's <laughs> that's enough bristling. Oh, let's look at the season standings. I don't really want to because they're terrible. Oh, look at me down there in 35th place. Oh, well. As always, thanks for watching, and I will see you around.